hey guys welcome back to the channel welcome back to the another video this is the ios 18 running on my iphone 14 although ios 18 is not out for the public yet but it is pretty much in very good stable shape in today's video i'm going to talk about how you can install the ios 18 before the release of the ios 18 public version but before that i'm going to give you a couple of reasons that why should you install ios 18 right after watching this video so watch this video till the end and i'm sure you are definitely going to install ios 18 on your device also you don't need any sort of computer or mac to install this version you just need your iphone along with the internet connection so we'll begin this video well i was 18 one of the biggest update of this decade that comes with amazing customization abilities that are available over here now finally finally you can place your icons wherever you want you can place your widget wherever you want if i show you you can place your widget wherever you want just like this one you can place your icons anywhere to enhance your experience this sort of customization was never um, there with the any ios version but now it is available with the ios 18 which is insanely insanely good also as you can see these are the dark icons over here if i show you over here these are dark icons that matches the dark mode which is really really good it makes the device look very aesthetically very cool and if i go over here in the jiggle mode tap on this edit button over here like this one there is a new customize tab available only with the ios 18 as you can see if i go over here again sorry for this one over here there is a new customize tab available over here it gives me couple of more options from here you can select the mode for your icons maybe light mode dark board automatic one that um, syncs with your ios um, dark board or light mode also the tinted one so by tapping on this i will get all the icons in the lighter version in the darker version automatic set with you i can also dim out the wallpaper if i want like this sort of customization was never in the ios but now it is available uh, with the ios 18 also if i want tinted one i can also get any color to match with my wallpaper as you can see not every color looks good but there are some colors which looks really good really good but honestly i really like these darker versions which look really really good along with that there are many tons of tons of features in the ios 18 there is a new password application available from where you can store your password codes keys uh, pass keys wi-fi and many other stuff it makes everything very easy you don't need to install any third party application like LastPass or maybe bitwarden because this password application is already built in in your iphone uh, with the ios 18 there are amazing iMessages features also rcs is now available with the iphone now you can make the iMessage kind of conversation with the android user which looks really really good also there are different effects with the text are available as you can see there is a lot going on in the ios 18 it is not possible to cover all the features in a single video but are you thinking about that maybe it's a beta version so maybe battery life will not be good maybe performance will not be good well 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 this iOS 18 right now over here gives the best Geekbench score ever, especially on the iPhone 14 over here. So if I go to the Geekbench application over here, going to the latest Geekbench score, which I did run on iOS 18 public beta 5, or you can also call it iOS 18 developer beta 7. Single core is 2316, multi core is 5626. If I show you the average one over here, 2316 is of ios 18 average is 2042 ios 18 score is better over here 5626 is from the ios 18 average is 5473 so ios 18 score is better which means there are no compromise when it comes to the performance performance is really really good also if i show you the battery life 
going into the settings then going to the battery stats over here now battery is also in a new section which looks better going to the last 10 days over here over this day where i used my phone for around 75 to 80 percent i got screen on time of 8 hours and 17 minutes which is insane so there are no compromise with the battery life there are no compromise uh, with the performance at all after reaching the ios 18 public beta 5. so these are some of the reasons that i think you should install ios 18. i think this is the best time to install this update and uh, before the release of the uh, public version that is going to be released next month now how you can install this update how you can install the ios 18 public beta 5 it's a very simple process no you don't need computer or macbook at all so if i if i go to the safari you need to visit this website apple beta software program the website is beta.apple.com now you need to visit this website over here and after going over here you need to sign up over here as you can see there is a big sign up button over here you need to sign up make sure you sign up using your apple id that you have placed over here so use this apple id to sign up over here so as you can see it is asking me to sign in because i, I am already signed up so i'm not going to sign up again so once you sign up for this a software program you need to restart your iphone now once you have restart your iphone you are on the simple page maybe running ios 17 or 16 or 15 i don't know you need to go to settings you need to go to journal you need to go to software update and after coming over here you need to go you will see a new option name as beta updates you need to go to beta updates select ios 18 public beta option just like this one just like i had done come back and now you will see the ios 18 update i have already updated so i'm not uh, it is not showing me but you guys will see this update and by installing this update you will be able to enjoy a lot of new features that are available with this update again this is one of the biggest update in last decade it comes with most customization and many other useful features calculator app is revamped amazing features in the calculator app definitely i will make more videos regarding that also this ios 18 update is available starting from the iphone se second generation up to the latest iphone so iphone se second gen iphone 10s 10r iphone 11 and up to the latest iphones on these all iphones you can install the ios 18 update well this was small and simple video talking about why you should install the ios 18 and how you can install the ios 18 on your iphone if you like this video let me know in the comment section below what do you think about this video just let me know and what ios version are you using are you excited for the ios 18 public release next month also let me know that in the comment section below well i will see you in my next video until that take care peace out